In the first season of One Hour Limit Locked, we set ourselves the challenge to get a fire cape in 45 days while only being able to play for one hour a day. I went 36 minutes overtime on the last day, but we got our cape in the end. The thing is, that was only the warm up. Now, we're really about to start cooking. 60 days are on the clock, 175 quest points are on the menu, 8 council members are in need of a charming knight in shining armour, and I'm the idiot they're getting. Welcome to season 2 of One Hour Limit Locked, it's chef in season baby. Hello again everyone, we are about to kick off day 3 here of our hunt for the Barrow's Gloves. We've got just a step or two of fairy tale before we can get into our main portion of the quest in today. And we need to get our cat on the floor. He needs our attention, possibly, so we'll stroke him. Okay. Have I got wealth on? Yes, I do. Just want to stop at this bank real quick. We don't need the passage. Oh, uh, we do actually, because I've just realised my plan for getting back to the Grand Tree doesn't work. I was going to go from GE. We don't need the food right now. Don't think we need combat runes right now. This is now when we get the cuts in. Yeah. Best court scene in the game. After we finish this quest off, we are gonna go do the Grand Tree. We did already begin it. Got the back sample in the translation book here, so I can go see Hazelmere as soon as we unlock the fairy rings. Oh, I should've got a sardine, but we'll be banking soon anyway. Just after Hazelmere, we're gonna go to the GE. Classic RuneScape quest, make me run back and forth. Feel super inefficient because I don't have any bolts or anything to do. I'm actually going to be investing in some low level alchemy casts to passively try my magic as I'm doing any running around for these quests. I think that's the best way to do it moving forward because the bolt cost will add up if I carry on with it. Especially as we get into the higher tiers of bolts, there's just complete sinking in your money, you know, no return on it. Whereas low level alchemy, we can pretty much break even and maybe even make a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of profit. Not that would notice it particularly. I am pretty sure we have fairy rings now. So I can get rid of that. Because I'm not going to this location. I'm going to Hazelmere's. Where's Hazelmere's? CLS, not ALS. Alright, we now have access to fairy rings, folks. Finally. As if these spiders are aggressive. Oh no. Okay, return to the Grand Tree. So we're gonna go to the Grand Exchange first. I don't know where we got that from, but I'll sell it. Those cosmic runes, cause we need to sell them. Uh, I guess these emerald bolts as well. A ring of wolf to sell. Don't need a staff of war right now. We are getting ourselves a lava bottle staff and a lot of the shit. Need to put some shit away, apparently. I'm pretty sure I can combine these now. Yeah. And we don't need all of this stuff just at the minute. Just buying up the shit for a whole bunch of different quests here. A whole bunch of different little quests that we're planning to get done. Okay, bank some more of the shit that we don't actually need right now. Don't need all of these different stacks, I can just do one at a time. Don't need the meat, or the dwell berries, or the eye, or that. I'm just trying to get myself organised. Okay, I want this. I'm gonna put it up. Okay. Alright, we have a room pouch. We are invested in... In room pouching. <laughs> uh, don't actually need that yet, do I? Um, ball of wool. Just one of them. Let's use it on the cat right now. Let's feed him so he's good for another half hour. 
And I think we go back to the Grand Tree. Okay, so it's like up here. Perfect. So we will just be low alkin as we're running around to get extra magic XP. It's just one nature room per cast, and it's actually a really quick animation compared to High Alk. Did not know that. Feels it anyway. Maybe it's not, but it feels it. Never used Low Alchemy before, but here we are trying to zero time our magic. I might actually move Tree Gnome Village up in my list as well and do that sooner rather than later. I want to be careful I don't accidentally alk something I care about. <laughs> Put plenty of space around that plate skirt. Not this dickhead. Perfect intake ladder with the Alkin. Boom. Smashed it. Hey jerk, what's this I found in your books? I can do what I want, motherfucker. Or did I just... I alked my way out of being arrested. That's all you gotta do. You get arrested, folks. Just alk. No right at all. In Karamja. Please no juggles. Damn right he's sorry to have kept me. I'm on a fucking time trial here, mate. Making me give you the password like I don't work here. Uh, I'm gonna have to talk to him because I didn't bring any combat runes. Yeah, my cat gets to be privy to the conversation. Okay, now I need to get there again and I don't have... A way to teleport there. So I'm gonna have to get another necklace of passage, ah. I can't think of another way to get there. I don't think you can buy slayer rings. It's gonna have to be. This is why I need to get the trees unlocked. This would be so much easier, I could just go from the tree over there. The E3 magic, we now have telekinetic grab. Orders from who? Wait, Femi. Where's Femi? Do I just have to talk? Thanks, mate. Never done that before. I think I've always had spirit trees. I'm not gonna lie, this is making me feel a bit like a maniac. Fucking alk in between ladders. Like, who the fuck do I think I am, really? Who, who the fuck said I could do shit like that? Would it be okay? Some degenerate level shit. Ah, yeah, I'll take the key back. Cheers. Thanks, Anita. Lifesaver. Let's go rob this guy for everything he's worth. Little dickhead, I'm about to write you out. Don't meow, you'll give us away! We're breaking into my man's house here. Oh, I didn't bring combat runes! Am I gonna have to tell it out? I'm gonna have to tell it out. But then I can't get back in. I'm gonna exit that. I don't know how I got out of that, but I did. All I need to do is grab, grab some chaos runes. Get a sardine as well, I'll worry. Oh no, my stack moved. I guess we don't have fireball yet. 35, yeah. A little bit off. Mm, that's 34. I don't know how I managed to exit out of that. It's really weird. But I'm glad. Uh, it's not the best time, Mr. Beekeeper. But do we have to be in this spot? That's it. Alright, I'm gonna have a whiz. I'm not gonna lie, I'm desperate. I'm praying for some good RNG on these Deconia rocks. Please, first route. I'm begging. Mummy! Oh, what a little pussy. You're gonna disappear, are you? Get gone, dickhead. Your demon's not even that tough. It didn't even get me a magic level. Okay, I feel like everyone always goes this way first. So I'm gonna go the other way. Apparently I can't get past that. Got it! That wasn't too bad, that was like the 5th or 6th. Nice. Just stock up on the alcohols at a bank. Excellent! All that attack XP as well. We can finally wield that rune sim. And we got a magic level up to Firebolt. Now, not bad at all. I think I'm gonna replace what I was previously planning to do with Tree Gnome Village. Because I just want to get it done. And we don't need fuck all for it, just an axe. So, we're, we're Gucci. And I don't need this shit ever. So, drop all our bollocks. 
Okay, where are we going after this as well? Trinome Village, Plague City, Ardune, but we can't actually get to Ardune in any real way. How are we gonna get here? Urgh. CIQ? Yes, that's how we're gonna do it. Fairy ring to CIQ. Closest fairy ring. Gosh, I don't know where a good fairy ring is. All I can think is GE and. Okay, well, I'm just gonna stop scrolling and go to the fucking Grand Exchange. Gonna want another stamp as well. How are we already halfway through? That's crazy. Gosh, what was it? Already forgotten. CIQ. I think I can click it from here. A bit wild if it actually worked. Wait, what happened to my... Oh, right, yeah. I swear, if this takes me all the way to the gate, I will be amazed. Oh, no, there it goes. At least we've got something to do for the run. Being as efficient as we can be. 36 magic? So if I got a whole magic level, just run in the maze. Gonna just cut down some trees while I'm here. Need six logs for the actual quest. So I know what sort of the king and chop a couple more. Can we use Alcoy now? He didn't make me run back out, does he? Oh, I don't get to chop. Let's find this trees here. Sweet, so we can use Alcoy now. We never have to run that again. Desperate for some wood. He's gagging for it. Drooling for that wood. Boom. Man, I remember when I was a kid and this quest sounded scary. I was like, oh, I have to go into a tower and get the, the orbs of protection. Look at this, it's a whole battlefield. I was terrified of this place. Like one of the easiest quests in the game. I'm just an idiot. Oh no. Don't even think of taking, oh, just chase for let me know it was it, mate. If I wasn't already sure because quest helper, I'd surely know now, wouldn't I? Dumbest cunt in the universe. Alright, there we go. Now we can go out front door, can't we? Because somehow we got the key, even though it, it was locked. I guess it could just be like bolted. We still have to kill that other guy, don't we? There's another orb. I don't take that long, I don't think. Yeah, 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 stop yapping, let me go deal with it. This didn't make me walk all the way over there again. Alright, where is the cunt? Oh, uh, my kitten needs feeding. There we go. Man, this guy is so fucking far. What is he doing out here, really? I don't know exactly where the safe spot is. But is he over here? I feel like you got to get him trapped on a tree. And I don't care enough, so... Look at me go! Missed an attack then, but we're not going to talk about it. Finally, dickhead. Okay. Now we have to run all the way back down again. Almost done with Trino Village though. Not going to get very far today. These quests, they're not all as quick and easy as, I don't know, even stuff like Observatory. Well, they're, they're often as easy, but not as quick. See, this is the thing, I talk about how efficient I am when I'm in the middle of a fight and I'm alking or I'm going up ladders or whatever. And then I run all the way back to fucking Elkoi and just forget about it the entire way there. <sighs> Let's say seven magic though. Tell me we're done. Let's go. Some more attack XP as well. We're gonna go straight to Khazard. No time to waste. It's Plague City, baby. Oh, we got no Mamula as well. But let's get rid of that. Cool. Can we hop over that? We can, right? We can, right? Yeah, it's green. At least it got me out on the right side. I'm not. I'm not mad about that. Okay, we don't need gloves, key, or an axe. Don't think, anyway. Uh, we need a spid, but we got one. We need the dwell berries, we need a rope, we need the hang. Press the wrong key. Hang over cure, and some more alks. I guess I'll just bring all of them, because I've got plenty of invent space. Oh, the buckets of water. I didn't bring them. Did I not get any? Okay, I guess I'll just take buckets. Pretty sure there's a water source by him. Yeah, it's there. Yeah, if you let me out of this dialogue window, I will. Just getting through this as efficiently as I can. Don't worry, Ellie, I got ya. Alright. So, we now know how to use the Ardy teleport. Very nice. We're also up to 18 mining. 
and we can go talk to Eleanor over here to start the next quest, Biohazard. Uh, House of the Northern Eye, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go over here. Wanted to go to the bank anyway. Make sure I got all my teleports. Okay. Uh, Varrock. Okay, we do have a mourner to kill. I don't know if I like it though. There was something else I wanted. Oh, the witch's potion stuff. Because I'm going to be in Ruinton for this quest. Oh, no, I'll let my energy slip. Right, time to poison these cunts. And there is 38 magic, 675 total level. Not bad at all. Sorry, mate, you're dead. Can't just walk out, can I? I have to go down to the guy. Don't think we're going to finish this quest. We might just, but don't feel like we will. Okay, so we can just POH Telly. And while we're here, we're the witch. They're the witch. Oh, is there no stove here? Oh no, there's a stove right there. Gotta be a rat somewhere as well. Gotta be a rat somewhere. I'm sure I'll see it. Okay. Hops. The sulfuric broiling. Cool. Uh, so Varok is the next step, so I need to find that rat and finish Witch's Potion to the west. There we go. I knew there'd be one nearby. So hard to fucking see it, aren't they? Why did I buy Varok teleports when I have the runes? There's a little bit more magic XP. Okay, and on with Biohazard. Gonna be a push. Don't think we'll quite finish. But we do, because it makes my job a lot easier in editing when I don't have to look at the previous episodes to figure how long I spent on a quest. Right, I could do with another sardine. Need more stamina run. Not that many. Put me completely full inventory. Alright. Is this actually it? Oh my god, we are actually going to finish. Don't jinx it. Maybe we're not. We're going to run from here to here. I was hoping to get the RD Easy Diary done today, but I didn't plan to do True Gnome Village. And it took us a while to just buy everything up at the GE. But we've got stuff for the next few quests. Quite a way down the list. Like, the, tomorrow we don't have to spend any time at the GE buying stuff for quests. We're sorted, so that's good. Okay, I am going to pick up my cart. And then see if we can get through this. Come on! We'll finish that off first thing tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's so frustrating. Okay, well, what did we do today? We got the Grand Tree, Tree Gnome Village, Plague City done. We just did Witch's Potion as well, and we have pretty much finished Biohazard. That will give us some thieving XP, as well as open up the RD Easy Diary, which is my plan for the start of tomorrow after we turn this in. After that few more little quests and then we start moving on to some of the larger ones with larger experience rewards possibly some training in the midst i'm not sure it's been a good so far though it doesn't feel like we did a lot today but i feel like we actually did do a lot today i don't make any sense did i just said the exact contradictory things i've ticked four things off my quest list with a fifth that's going to be ticked off like straight away uh, we're all the way up to 38 magic, so that's good. 43 attack as well, also improvements. 18 mining, also an improvement. Yeah, the magic's the main one really there, but the attack is nice as well. Just let us use that rune scimitar now. Oh, and we got some agility XP as well, we're up to 33. We were on 29 before, so yeah. 32 magic we're on, 10 mining, 36 attack. Lots of levels getting today, lots and lots of levels, and we'll have some thieving levels coming, like I say, as soon as we talk to King Lathus. But for now, that is going to be it on this one. If you enjoyed the video, please do leave a like on it. It helps a ton, both pushing me out into the algorithm and also just letting me know that you enjoy the work I'm producing. 
leave a comment down below and let me know if you're enjoying the series so far if you hear from season one or new to season two oh, i don't know it could be could be fun if people have joined sort of midway here but uh yeah hit that sub button too i don't know why i get so bad at doing outros sometimes i guess i'm just kind of awkward take care of yourself look after one another i'll see you on the next one